question here is breaker and the ram cycle out of packaging and this set looks gorgeous i really think it turned out great it has a modern take modern feel to it i'm glad they didn't use the old 80s motorcycles and and they gave it a modern look i mean this is a definitely a modern looking motorcycle gatling gun even breaker himself you know, looks like he's got modern tech modern uniform and a modern helmet so the cycle itself it's got a kickstand right here you can Stand it up like that so it doesn't fall off or tip over. Uh, the side-mounted Gatling gun has a separate wheel. The wheels are, I think, made of plastic, although they feel like rubber. Rubberized plastic, if that was something. But it is definitely plastic. Uh, and it rolls wonderfully, very smoothly. That sound you're hearing is from this wheel. <laughs> Gatling gun right here. <laughs> Okay, handlebars, they can actually move so that you can swivel that front wheel. Very nice, I thought that was a nice touch. It's got lots of decals, tempos right here, GI Joe, MG 1027, got more here. Don't know if the original Ram Cycle actually had these things, because I never had it. But yeah, it's very cool. You can detach the sidecar, or not the sidecar, the side weapon. So, so it's a, it's a motorcycle on its own. And the motorcycle will actually fit two G.I. Joe classified series figures. Okay, let me get rid of this. Yeah, neat looking motorcycle, lots of details. You can clearly see right here, there's the engine block sculpted in, some armor plating, toolbox right there, rear light, brake light, headlamp. Clear windshield, you got some gauges right here, gas tank, seat, wheels, even the uh, the rims of the wheels and the, I guess the brake, the brakes have been molded in, exhaust, just a really, really wonderfully made uh, vehicle uh, by Hasbro. Figure itself, breaker was as basic as <laughs> any G.I. Joe figure uh could get uh he he didn't come with a pistol or anything he came with a backpack with a plastic hose i think that you stuck into his headgear his headgear never had a visor it had that communication thing and he was communication so the old vintage g1 toys he never had a gun and in, in the anniversary uh 3.75 inch the more modern versions of breaker he did have a pistol so I don't know. The, the figure looks great on its own. You can remove the helmet. Reveal a... Uh... <laughs> Does this Is this what Breaker looked like in the cartoon? I don't think so. Anyway. Uh, it it kind of... I don't know who he looks like. I, I can't remember. But does he look like Bradley Cooper? No, I don't know. Anyway, he's got this vest. He's got that plain green uh, uniform on him. And... That's it. That's all he has. I, I just wish they would have given him a backpack, a communications backpack, and maybe a sidearm, pistol, and a holster. That would have made this figure perfect, I think. Uh, that's my only nitpick. But other than that, I think it's a great breaker figure. Look at that head sculpt. Very nicely painted. And then the vest. I don't know how to remove the vest. I'm not going to even try and do so. He's probably got a plain shirt underneath. Uh, yeah. And they've recycled Duke's arm, I suppose. Plain boots. I like it. I, I don't know why. Uh, the plainness of the figure, I like. But the lack of accessories uh, is kind of putting me off. I kind of wish, because you're, buying, you're paying a lot for this set, I kind of wish they would have given him more than just the cycle. He does, I guess the weapon that he came with, other than the motorcycle, is probably this Gatling gun. This Gatling gun is actually removable from the box. You can remove it this way. And seriously, this is Roadblock's weapon. He can he can hold it if you want him to. And I'm pretty sure this is the same Gatling gun we're going to get with that Cobra Island Roadblock. But seriously, Breaker holding a Arnold Schwarzenegger Terminator 
Gatling gun. I'll be back. No, this is this is definitely not working. I, mean, I love the fact that you can remove it and use it as a weapon, but they should have given him a device. Like if it's modern times now, they should have given him a communicator, like a satellite phone or anything like that. Maybe a nice, yeah, the communications backpack, the field communications pack, and yeah, a pistol would have been nice. But you know, it's okay. This is what we get. I guess all the money went into this RAM cycle and all that. So, okay. And for some size comparisons, here is Breaker with Scarlet and Duke. And you clearly see that arm has been recycled from Duke as well as this other arm. Uh, I think even the even the shoulders have been recycled uh, from Duke. A lot of old G1 fans, like me in particular, who lived through the 80s watching G.I. Joe's, they're going to want Breaker. And just a quick rundown of... Articulation, uh, ball joint and neck, it's on a hinge. Uh, lower ball joint on the base of the neck, or right here. Ball jointed upper torso, shoulders, butterfly joints, can, both shoulders can go in and out, forward and backward, bicep swivel, double jointed elbows, wrist swivel, this one goes in and out, this one goes up and down. Drop down, ball jointed hips, goes through the splits, do forward and backward. On my copy of the figure, the ball joints are a little bit loose. It's okay. I mean, I, I'm used to it. I always get the quality control defects. Anyway, uh, thigh swivel. All the other joints are tight. It's just weird that the drop-down ball joints are loose on mine. Double-jointed knees. Calf swivel. Hinge ankles with the rocker tilt. And so some final thoughts on this breaker with the Ram Cycle set. I think it's a great set. Uh, definitely one of the better sets or figures in the classified line. I just wish they could have given Breaker more of his communication accessories. But other than that, this set is an absolute must-have. If you are a big fan of the original G.I. Joe cartoons and characters and whatnot, because I think Hasbro did a wonderful job on this set. With that, I'm going to give the set a 9.5 out of 10. Those small things they could have improved on it would have made this a perfect set. Best of luck to everybody hunting this set down. Let me know in the comment section what you thought of this Alvin Breaker Kibby with Ram Cycle set. Hit that notification bell so you never miss out on any of my latest video reviews. And if it's your first time here, please subscribe. Thanks for watching.